one of the more familiar events in plate tectonics is the mid-Paleozoic fusion of the southern landmass, Gondwana, with the northern land masses to form the supercontinent Pangaea, which then split at the end of the Triassic period. The continents, however, had been moving prior to this, and in the mid-Proterozoic eon, from a period of about 1.2 billion years ago to 900 million years ago, it seems that there was a previous supercontinent known as Rodinia. At its center was the landmass Laurentia, which included most of Canada, Greenland, and the north-central United States. Baltica, which included north-central Europe, and between them, a island arc or the beginnings of the microcontinent Proto-Avalonia. This landmass would later contribute both parts of Europe, uh, such as uh, parts of Spain, France, and the British Isles, and parts of the Appalachian region of the United States, down into Carolina and even Florida. But at this point, it was simply an island arc. Some modern continents existed as separate land masses. South America, for example, existed as Amazonia, the Brazilian region, and the separate Argentine Rio de Plata. And then small microcontinents, including the pre-Cordillera uh, from uh, near the Appalachians, would end up also incorporated in South America. Africa existed as separate regions, West Africa, Congo, and Kalahari. Madagascar was fused to India and would remain so for most of their history. East Antarctica was present close to North America. Western Australia uh, was present close to Western uh, uh, Laurentia. And Asia was present as separate blocks of North China, Siberia, and several smaller blocks. In geology, the word orogeny refers to a mountain building event. And in the Proterozoic Eon, as the supercontinent Rodinia formed with the fusion of land masses, the subduction of some plates under others, the compression of plates, a major orogeny, the Grenville orogeny, occurred, which resulted in many mountain ranges. Original name for Grenville in Newfoundland and Canada, where exposed rocks are available for study. Uh, this orogeny contributed to uh, mountains uh, such as the Adirondacks and the Blue Ridge Mountains. And depending how this is classified, if extended beyond uh, the North America Baltic uh, region, uh, then other ranges as well.